Good morning, everyone. Um, we've had a bit of a lie-in this morning. We're really, really tired. Um, but breakfast has just arrived. We had it delivered to our room because we didn't want to wait in a queue for um, the main dining room or the buffet, did we? No. So that plan, I think, worked out pretty well. Hi everyone, welcome to the third and final episode of our second MSC Virtuosa UK Staycation Cruise Series. Today we would spend the day at sea as MSC Virtuosa leisurely bobbed around the English Channel on her way back to Southampton. So we're working our way through our toast and pastries. Yeah. And Luke's got his coffee, so he's happy. Yeah, I feel loads better. The bread's nice. Yeah, it's um, it's supposed to be white bread, but I think it can miss a whole meal or something. It's nice, there's a change. Mm. So. Well, we're all ready. <laughs> all changed and showered and freshened up. We've had a hell of a lazy morning today. It's about midday, I think. It's about dinner time now, but you know, we're on holiday, so we're going to chill out. It's, right. it's been nice. We've had the door and all open, and you could hear the sea outside, which was really nice. Um, we don't know what we're going to do today because it's not exactly sunny outside. So we're probably going to go walk the deck first, get some fresh air, see what it's like outside properly, and then we're going to go down to Jean shops. Philippe's. Jean Philippe's. We'll try some chocolate, I think. Yeah. That'd get some hot fun. chocolates, some of that. Yeah, let's give that a go. Although overcast, the weather wasn't too bad. I suppose it could have been raining, so we couldn't complain really. It was nice taking in some fresh air out on deck and admiring the scenery. We love being out at sea. Not even doing one lap around the walking track. The smell of food cooking at the poolside grill proved way too tempting. Would it be a bit piggy to eat burger and chips? No, not really. I suppose it's better than just eating chocolate, isn't it? As hardly anyone was waiting for food, we figured it was a sign, I guess, so we made our way over straight away. So what do you go for? Is it um, a sea burger? Yeah. Cheeseburger and chips. Cheeseburger. Yeah, I've, well, you went I've got a cheeseburger too. So how much stuck into that? It's nice. I'm loving it. It's good, isn't it? And it was from the outside bar, so we didn't even have to go to the buffet or anything to get it. It's quite nice. So we just had a little snack, didn't we? And now we're going to go and see what the inside feels like. We're not going to go swimming, but just to see what it's like. And then we're going to go down to the gallery, aren't we? One of MSC Virtuosa's great features is a retractable glass roof over the tropical pool. On days like today, this is ideal and as you can see, makes the tropical pool a popular choice for families. Last time we cruised on MSC Virtuosa, we didn't manage to visit Jean-Philippe's Chocolate Café, so this time round we decided to make a point of it. Not that we needed much persuading. As you can see, there's plenty of sweet treats and tasty goodies to sample, or if you can resist temptation, bring back home as gifts. Although we had the Premium Plus drinks package, which covers a huge selection of drinks on board, unfortunately the hot chocolates here weren't included, but they looked so tasty we just had to give them a go. I'm just going to go for the classic hot chocolate. You I think I'm going to go for the Rocky Road. You're having that one? Yeah. Oh cool, that'd be nice. So the man just said he saw there was a table over by the window and, and he moved us over here, didn't he? Yep. He's so really good. He's really, really nice, really helpful actually. He's brilliant. Um, so yeah, for now we're sitting by the window. We have a lovely view. And it looks like it might brighten up as well. That's fantastic. Thank okay. you very much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. How's your hot chocolate? Bang in. Very good, is it? Really looks tasty. Really looks tasty, is it thick? Yeah. The cream on that. It's not thick. It's not like a thick, thick one, but it is thicker than like. Mm. Yeah. That cream was like ice cream. It was so tasty. It's really thick. I love it. I haven't got to the bottom yet. I'm too scared to get um, cream in my beard. So I'm eating a bit of it with a spoon first. So 
so we just had a nice uh, cup of hot chocolate in uh, John Philippe's chocolate yeah, place, it was really nice. And now we're going to go to the Car of Salons because we heard an announcement to say that the show might be changed. So we're going to find out what's going on over there. So that's where we're heading next. And then we're going to go back to our room because we have to drop because we bought a chocolate. So we're going to drop that back off to the room, aren't we? Yeah. And then we'll see what happens after that. Oh, there's a treat in there as well. Yeah, he put a little treat in there for us. <laughs> it's really, really nice. His name was Jonas, but he was brilliant, wasn't he? He's really helpful. Back to the room. And our lovely balcony. Sun's coming round as well, by the looks of it. Isn't it? Yeah. Nice to get the sun balcony. We have got a little bit. So yeah, just been enjoying the scenery. Don't, haven't seen any dolphins today. And then the man came and filled up the mini bar, didn't he? Yep. So he's done that. Um, and the show's changed tonight. We had to cover which one we were going to do, but it's changed. The show's changed, even though we're still going down to the carousel lounge, aren't we? Yep. Um, so now, Gavin wants to go for a walk around the prom deck, because we've only done it once earlier on, and he didn't feel like that was enough. And then more exercise. Yeah, and then when I'm walking around, I want to have a look, see if the, either the water slides are empty or if there's a bar or if it's quiet up on top deck maybe I'll go in the pool but I, I, I think it's going to be busy but we'll see we'll see let's go and have a look let's see shall we so now we're exercising because Gavin wants to walk the idea of walking off our food seemed like a good plan but the jogging come walking track circles the poolside grill and is only one deck up from the marketplace buffet meaning you're hit with the heavenly aromas of food cooking so instead of burning off calories you end up scoffing down more so we've done a little bit of walking and then when we're walking on the other side we saw the atmosphere pool look quieter than the horizon pool, isn't it? So, yeah, quieter because the pool is really busy. So we're going to go back to the atmosphere pool now, aren't we? Um, was walking past the, the pizza counter, weren't we? And there was no one there, so we were like so happy. We decided to get a little snack. So I'm having fish and chips. And you want to have a fish? And we've got pizza, pizza. Slice of pizza. pizza. Yeah, a little slice of pizza in the middle. So that's what we're going to do now. And then hopefully I might, I might go for a swim and see, and see if Gavin gets a drink. I'm going for a lager and a nice uh, glass of red wine. We've got Gavin's, not the same. We both queued up, one of us got two people between us, and we all did the same thing, didn't we? So that we could, yeah, make a good start on it. And now, we're by the pool, ta-da! We've got in these comfy beds, but Gavin's freezing cold, so he's, he's got a towel around. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to probably have these drinks, go in the pool for a little splash about, and then I'm going to go down there, don't we? Probably. Yeah, just head to the freezer. 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 warm in here anyway. Mm. Well it was only cold in the pool. It's only cold when you get out of the pool. That's when it's cold. So yeah now we have to go out to the room to park. Park, um, chill out the balcony, have a glass yeah, of wine or two. Uh, we've got lager in there. Lager, gin. Just mix it all up. Might be messy. And we've got the show tonight. Anyway, what time is the show? Come past seven. Nothing beats enjoying a nice glass of wine out on your own private balcony. Having this aft-facing cabin was great. We absolutely loved it. So, this was the treat we had. Show the people the treat we had. Chocolate what macaroon. You've got a rack. Yes. Not really a macaroon. It's like, um, it's got a biscuit base and all to it, hasn't it? Like cake. Yeah. It's a nice little cake. We're and they normally cost £2.30. But the man, the man, yeah, the man gave it to us as a gift because we bought the thing from the shop, didn't we, which is in the bag. So we're going to have half of this each now, on a balcony. We've been drinking wine. So we're going to go out on the balcony with a snack. And then we're going to get ready, aren't we? Coconutty. Where is that? Um, it's a bit like a chocolate brownie. Yeah. Okay, cool. Well, I want some now. My turn. Mmm, very dense, very, yeah, coconut. My teeth are killing. Mm. But it's nice. Mmm. Sa, sa. <laughs>
sad, sad, sad face, sad. End of the cruise, feeling really bad. We're going down to Carousel Lounge because we've already packed our case, and then we're going to get totally smashed. We can get off our face. Ta da! Hi, hey, everyone. So we're all dressed kind of smart ish and tonight Casual. we are going to the carousel lounge to watch a show which and we paid, we paid for we can't remember what it's called we were supposed to watch the other one but that got cancelled so watching the other one there's chess two or something, it's it? about chess it's like rock chess i don't know so we're gonna watch that and if it's anything like we've watched in the past like Cirque du Soleil that'd be good that'd be really good we, we, we have paid for this and we pre-booked it didn't we? Pre yeah, I think it was it. £9 if you booked it before so, yeah. it was 15 if and you do, you do get a cocktail or a drink included so I'll see if I can get myself another like glass of red wine and then what we're going to do then tonight we haven't got any specialty dining room then we're going to go to the main dining room aren't we? we'll just see how it goes so anyway I'm drink my drink take that down go to Carousel Lounge watch the show then have some dinner and we'll take you all along for the ride so it'll be fun after taking some photos of each other out on my balcony, we made our way down to the carousel lounge. On arrival, we were offered a complimentary cocktail to enjoy whilst we watched the show. I'm very tall there, Luke. Because I don't know how to lower my seat. Doesn't matter, I'll be fine. I'll get a good view. We really enjoyed the show, it was absolutely fantastic. It has to be said, we couldn't really follow the story, but from a visual point of view, it was very impressive. The performers were very talented and enjoyable to watch. So Luke's have been impressed. No, I, I normally watch a show and I get bored, but I didn't get bored. This was really good. Hi everybody. Hi. So we just come back to the room and we watched the show and the show was, I loved it. It was, really, it was really, really good. Very entertaining. The music was awesome. And we had like, I had two free cocktails and it was brilliant. And um, we've just come to the room now because our bags are out and we're going to put our cases out now, aren't we? We've got late dinner tonight. We've got late dinner, so we're going to go down to the dining room next and put these bad boys out. And then, yeah, go and eat food and get drunk. The show, the show was really good. I was really impressed with it. It was, it was awesome. I hate this. Part. It's the most sad part ever. I hate the end of the crew. It really makes me sad. It was yours. This is yours. I'm just checking. I've got everything. I'm sure they perfectly meshed the room. You can get a flat case like this out. See, I got like. Multiverse wheels. Are we the only people putting our case out? Yeah, I think we're a bit early doing it. Yeah. yeah. Tonight, we would dine at our assigned dining room, the Symphony Restaurant. As you can see, there's a lot of choice on the menu. To study these options in more detail, just pause the video. I really like my soup, it's really nice. It's very tasty. I'm having a steak down now. What are you, what are you having? Um, having the pasta. Pasta. Oh, secret pasta. Oh, that'd be nice. Okay, really good. And drink some wine as well. Enjoy. <laughs> Thank you. I'll push that there. That's great. That's lovely. Wow. Thank you. Thank you. Enjoy. We will do. Thank you very much. Enjoy. Wow. Look at that. So I've already started this people, this is my cheese board and over there you have my pork. Ta da! Gavin's got some cheese butter as well, haven't you? Mm -hmm. You enjoying it? It's good. So we've been eating already, yeah. You've got some grapes as well. Nice. Do you enjoy it? 
good. Oh, we just had a really nice meal at Symphony Restaurant. To be fair, it was really nice. It felt like a main diner. It was, it was alright, it was quite good. So, now what are we going to do, Gavin? Uh, <laughs> After having a delicious meal, we decided to have a wander around the ship to take in all the sights and walk off our food. MSC Virtuosa doesn't have a full wraparound promenade deck, instead it's sort of split in two. It's still nice having somewhere to step outside for a breath of fresh air, which is what we did before heading back to our cabin for the night. Uh, it's good night from me, and it's good night from Lukey. The following morning, we had arrived back at Southampton, followed into port by Queen Elizabeth. Today, unfortunately, our cruise on MSC Virtuosa comes to an end. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Well, we have to get off today. It's all come to an end. It's all finished. We've just thrown the last few bits and pieces into a case and our bag. Well, my bag's packed over there and yours is there. So yeah, the room's all cleared out. We've just checked our drawers and cupboards and there's nothing left behind. Um, I don't think we're going to bother with breakfast, do we? Don't think so, because it's probably going to be quite busy. <laughs> yeah, the ship's just so busy. So we're yeah. just going to skip the buffet now. Um, and I mean, 9.30, like... I think? Yeah, that's what time we're going to go. So we just need to find somewhere quiet now to hide, basically. Sky down, jump in, kid. Somewhere out the way, if we, yeah, but if we can. Oh, we have to leave our balcony now. We have to go. It's been really nice, though, isn't it? That's been a really like, good balcony, that. It's been really nice. The room's been quite nice, to be fair. It's natural. Yeah. I like the green. It, nice Gavin room. doesn't like the green, but well, it's been it's not been bad. So now we're all ready. We've done all of our final checks. We're ready for departure, aren't we? Ready for departure. Ready for departure. Bye. Nice cruise ship room, cabin. Next it's been really nice. Find it. I get my card out, and then the lights are off. My card. Let's go. After leaving our cabin, we decided to make our way up to the Sky Lounge, where we would wait until being called to disembark the ship. But then, change of plan. <laughs> breakfast. Breakfast. We went past and there wasn't much of a queue, and to be fair, we came through quite quickly, didn't we? It wasn't too bad in the end. So yeah, we decided to have some breakfast while we're here before our, our little journey comes. We've got quite a long way to go. Probably about five hours now, so we need this. Although we might stop for a cheeky KFC or something on the way, do you reckon? Yep. Breaks it up. Time to go. Time to go. <laughs> Time to go. I look at these stairs there, they're so nice, aren't they? We really hope you enjoyed this series, if you did, please give these videos a like and we'd be really grateful if you'd kindly consider subscribing to our channel so you can stay up to date with our latest videos. Thanks for watching.